So now I'm going to power on the units. So I'm gonna feed the power to the to the controller. Now the process value is 31 degrees. The the delay time is one minute. I'm gonna change it to uh, zero. So I I would press the I will I would tap on the set button. The temperature is 90 degrees, which is fine for the uh, for the for the demonstration. The delay time is one minute, so I'm gonna change it to zero minutes. The hold time is also also uh, zero, so I'm gonna. As soon as I change the uh, delay time and holding time to zero, uh, the controller goes to the heating up process. So the temperature started to go up. I have a heater right here. I have a heater right here, right? Temperature started to go up to to create the so I'm gonna change the setting value so you can see the alarm will be triggered. So now it's 49. I'm gonna change to 30. As soon as I change the setting value to 30, the alarm will be triggered immediately. Okay? As you can see, the alarm was triggered. Now the temperature keep goes up because of the uh, of the heating generated. I'm going to press the left arrow key and the decrease key to Okay, now we go back to the uh, delay phase. As you can see, the uh, indicator for delay just flashing, which pretty much indicates that the controller is in the delay uh, phase. You did you did not see any other indicators coming out uh, because we fixed the uh, the problem. Okay. Now I can fast forward to the uh, to the heating up process. I'm going to change the temperature to 90 degrees. The holding time would be one minute. Uh, solid stereo aid right here and I have a heater right here and I have a temperature sensor connected to the heater and goes all the way back to the controller The process value keeps going up. Now it's very close to 90 degrees. Let's see what will happen when it reaches to 90 degrees. Now it's 8, 89.1, 89.4. Okay, it's 90. The controller goes to the holding pattern for one sec, for one minute. You can see there, 
is a a pretty significant overshoot happens to 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 the heater. That's because I did not do the auto tuning. If I had done the auto tuning, there would be a very limited overshoot. So I hi I highly recommended that the customer have to perform the auto tuning uh, when they uh, install the controller to the to the equipment. Now one minute's just elapsed, so the controller goes to the to the uh, uh, permanent to the indefinite end uh, pattern. Uh, I can I can just uh, restart the controller by press this up key for three seconds. Okay, it goes back to the delay uh, pattern once again.